Hello and welcome back to the Old Greenbelt Theater. We are here again after quite a long hiatus and I'm excited to see you again, Caitlin. Good to see you too, Phoebe. And we're gonna talk about what is coming up at the Old Greenbelt Theater this week and next week as well. That's right, we have two exciting weeks coming up. First up is we are participating in the Wild Rumpus. So between 4.30 and 6.30 on Friday, we will have rolling shorts in the main auditorium. Just classic Halloween shorts. So we're gonna have some Casper and some Bugs Bunny and that sort of thing. So anytime that folks wanna drop in and see us while they're down here for the Wild Rumpus, we will be glad to see them. That and sounds fun. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it should be great. We're really glad to have the kids back. We love participating in the Halloween parade and that sort of thing. So we're really glad to, to see it return. Um, and then opening this Friday, we have Tar, the new film starring Kate Blanchett, and Triangle of Sadness. So that is uh, a Swedish film that uh, actually has Woody Harrelson playing the captain of a, a cruise ship for the ultra rich that runs into some mishap and mayhem. Yeah, after seeing the trailer for that one, I'm really excited for it. Me too. We're really entering the period of all the sort of Oscar season award films. So there's some really great things that are coming out. And I think that, that one where will balance nicely with um, Kate Blanchett playing a, a composer and, um, you know, a, a more serious piece of a Berlin woman in the music scene. And so, um, yeah, hopefully there's something for everyone. That sounds great. So what, what else is coming up that you know of? Yeah, so next week, starting on Friday, we have the South Korean neo-noir Decision to Leave, which has gotten a lot of um, buzz in the award season and looks to be really good as well. And so that and the other two will probably be sticking around. The um, Tar and uh, Triangle of Sadness will be with us that week as well. So we should have three films for people to choose from. So. Ooh, fun. Yeah. So. Outside of those three films, is there are there any other events or anything that you're you're planning for? Yeah, so like I said, we're in award season now, basically. So lots of great titles. We're hoping to bring Banshees of Inisherin, uh, which is Colin Farrell uh, in maybe the role of his lifetime. It's really excellent. Uh, and then we also hope to have the um, story of Emmett Till's life, Till. Uh, coming very soon as well. Um, for our free series, we for our Monday Matinee series, uh, Imitation of Life is our November title, so look out for that the first Monday uh, of November. And other than that, we're just looking forward to keeping the hits rolling with the Oscar season films through um, the end of the year. Great, well that all sounds fantastic. I'm really excited for some of those films and others. I'm excited to watch the trailer and find out more. Yeah, we are too. We're really excited to have all these great films coming in for the, the kind of the Oscar period from now through to the awards in, in you know, February, March time. So yeah, I'm hoping to watch more of them so I can get some ideas on which ones I predict to uh, win. <laughs> right, right. We gotta, we gotta get our two cents in and yeah. you know, yeah. Well, thank you so much, Caitlin. It's been really fun to do this again with you. And thank you all for watching.